Hi guys, welcome to our channel. Today I will be doing uh, one of the simple Christmas decor. I have these pine cones with me that I got it uh, with uh, Christmas decorations and I have a bird cage here and uh, also some uh, greenery. So I have always wanted to uh, decorate this cage uh, with uh, some uh, leaves or something but now since it is christmas i thought i'll do something with the uh, around uh, that area so i also have some beads here that i'll be using uh, let's get started i will uh, trim some of these uh, branches i think i can use a scissor I will cut them off uh, at uneven places like I want some to be tall, some to be shorter. If you don't want to make it as a Christmas decor, you can just uh, skip the uh, Christmassy part and uh, then you can decorate it. You can use it as your home decor. So this basically was my home decor project but uh, it got pushed too long and uh, it has become a Christmas project for now. So I have these many uh, greeneries ha hanging. Uh, I have a thin wire that I uh, am using to bind all this together. Just placing it randomly. Uh, If you don't have wires you can uh, always uh, directly stick to this uh, using your glue gun Just tighten it up a bit since it's it can be open from here and here I will attach my decor at the intersection so this uh, cage uh, you can buy it online Just insert it and twist it so that it sits. Make sure to seal the just like this. We have these leaves as well. Attach the leaves first. Where did it go? Okay. I'll attach it here. I'll simply keep it because I will. Uh, I want to make sure this opens. I'll 
do one thing, I'll attach it separately. So simply fix it with glue gun. So I'm using these three uh, leaves that I had shown previously and I'll attach it to my uh, cage directly. It looks like this somewhat. Now we'll attach the beads. We want to trim some beads, uh, like I want to trim its wires because I don't want all the beads to be of the same size. And it uneven sizes of these beads and I'll just keep inserting them here. I will spread out the bead so that uh, it gives more dimension as you can see. I will spread out the beads so that it gives more dimension. Just attach it wherever you feel like. There is no hard and fast rule that you will have to you have some what do you say rule to attach it here there and the angle you can attach it wherever you want this 
don't worry if this looks shabby we'll cover it up with this fine cone i think uh, i'm okay with the beads now i'll attach the fine cone a generous amount of glue whenever you are doing crafts you you should make sure that your uh, glue stick has to be of a good quality add this i'll attach another one how it looks now yeah. and add some glue to the back side as well just press it down for a while till it dries out which will take like a couple of seconds okay. I have two birds that fell off from one of my DIY project so, to be honest So let us attach it somewhere. Let us attach these birds now. Just attaching at the top of each pine cone. I will add some glue in between the fine cones to make this stick otherwise they look apart. remove the excess glue strings that come off not sure if I want this I don't think I want it right now so yeah this is it so this is how it looks so this is how it looks right now So there are only five items that are here one is the main one the bird cage uh, some greenery you can use it of your choice and some leaves uh, beads and the pine cones and the birds so i'll uh, i'll show you how it looks when I keep it on a surface above, like this will hang down, downwards. So. so 